Hello everyone, it's me again, Steedoja here, back with some more Dragon Ball Z Budokai Tenkaichi 3. I said Ultimate Tenkaichi in the last Budokai Tenkaichi 3 video, and that honestly sucks, because I shouldn't even be making uh, such, a, such a big mistake like that. Theme of this video is that we're actually going to use giant characters, and when I mean giant characters, I mean just giants. We're going to be using giant characters to fight off against great apes. So, again, obviously if you guys want to see more videos like this, I would say please... Leave a comment down below what you'd like to see. Um, don't forget to leave a like on the video as that greatly supports the video so more people can see it. And obviously, subscribe as that supports the channel so you can see what I upload. Okay? Okay, I'm going to just set the teams. There are five giant characters in this game and there should be more than enough great apes. So I'm just going to do that now. Okay, so I actually forgot how many Saiyans there were in this game that turned into great apes. There is like nine great ape characters in this game and I can obviously only put five on a team. So, I picked these ones. I decided I'd pick the traditional ones, like the standard grape, and obviously Vegeta. Um, and then I thought I would mix up a bit by showing you things you've never seen, like Grape Fasha and Grape King Vegeta. And I, of course, I have to put the strongest grape there, because I want this to at least be challenging. Not that grapes necessarily are bad fights, but some grapes are so slow that against other giant characters, they're completely screwed. Like, you guys remember. Even when I was playing as, uh, as Harudagon, Harudagon's not even a great, but he's just really, really slow. Harudagon is so slow that he struggles to beat Lord Slug because Lord Slug is, uh, you know, really, really quick. Let's pick him. Yeah, let's pick a map we I've never actually picked uh, on this channel before. Pick the Mountain Roads, mostly because I love. I'm addicted to the Mountain Roads. It's a got a very nice aesthetic of road, um, land, and water, and it's also got a nice little airspace. I mean, every goddamn Dragon Ball map has a nice little airspace to fight on. But I really, really like the way this map looks. Not to mention the road can be destroyed very easily when giant characters walk alongside it. So, let's see um, what goes on. Alright, that was a nice scream. Um, Dr. Wheelow is... I don't even know if anyone remembers Dr. Wheelow, but he, he... It took a spirit bomb to kill Dr. Wheelow. Oh yeah, you can't grab other giants. But Dr. Wheelow attacks very quickly, so he's gonna probably beat majority of the grapes on his own. Because he can stagger them in like one hit. You guys can see this, he's... Just trivializes good. Does he only have heavy finish? I think he only has heavy finish. Oh no, he had, he had a key cannon. Okay. Speaking of cannon... Oh, he doesn't... Yeah, he of course doesn't charge keys, a fucking robot. Wait, can I use... Okay, Photon Strike, whichever one this one is. Oh, that looks... That looks pretty cool. I'm gonna have to re-watch what his movie was. It's like World's Strongest or some shit. Oof. I, I love his combos. I'm really, really sorry. Playing, playing characters that I've not seen in a while again is just fun. That's all. Please forgive me, Gomendasai. For having fun. Oh. Okay. I'm. A, I'm. A, I've had it up to here with you. What's my? Oh, this is the charge move, right? Ooh. That's nervous strike on steroids. Jesus Christ. Will you? Will you now? Okay. What if I send in someone else? Uh, like the peel off machine. Not that anyone remembers Dragon Ball, but this is a thing that exists. I love how it's my saying, please hit. Oh yeah, my comes from Dragon Ball. People might have forgot to. Oh my god, he's got a barrage version of it. Um Can I just say Grape Vegeta's um the fur of his Grape form matches his white armor really well. Uh this Gatling gun is unironically better than Super 17's one. If I can If I can get if I can get it to happen. Just yeah, there we go. Awesome. It's better than Super 17 ones, because the bullets are bigger. Um, but the character obviously is not better than Super 17. Uh-oh, the peel-off machine cannot stagger a great Vegeta, uh-oh. I mean, to be fair, the peel-off machine was made to fight fucking Kid Goku. Oh no. Oof! <laughs> I love that so much. Oh my god, the heavy attack is just slamming the head on. Oh yeah, I need to show off the second super, which is some really, which is, wait, where is that? How do I do the missiles? Is that the ultimate? Okay, let me, Vegeta, Vegeta the second, you give me breathing room, it's over for you. 
Oh my god, he's so slow, but he staggers you for so long. Okay. Ooh. Alright, Vegito, your whole career is done from this point forward. Yes! These missiles are super overpowered. Cock rocket, boys. Cock rocket. Um. Uh, okay. Why does a giant have false courage? I get that false courage is mostly put on cowardly characters, but a giant doesn't need it already. That would have completely caved in his chest. Oof! Brain damage! Brain damage requiem. Jesus Christ. Okay, yeah, Fosh is a low class Saiyan, and low class Saiyans. Jesus Christ. Look, the. It, one really cool attention to detail. All of the local ass grapes in this game can't speak English. They just roar. So Raditz doesn't speak English. Farsha doesn't speak English. Bardock doesn't speak English. They can turn into grapes, but they just can't speak. And I find that very cool. Because Nappa can speak. As, as to add attention to detail, King Vegeta and Nappa can speak. I should probably um, swap characters. Let me, let me give you some bullet works. Hold on. There we go. Oh, damn. The monkey, the monkey dodged all of them. Uh, let's swap into Lord Slug, who is probably one of the best giants in the game, alongside Grave Baby. Lord Slug is just amazing. Oh, really? Oh, I didn't, I didn't know this track. Okay. How did you even avoid that? Oh, really? Hold on. <laughs> no, stop, stop. Fasha, stop. Oh, she still fights very similar. I like that a lot. Um, that means Fosh would have some control over her greater form, though, right? Because it, it still mimics her fighting style. I thought it would fight like all the other stupid monkeys. I mean, okay. That just sounds like an out of context freezer quote. And I'm. <laughs> I don't have to explain why. Um, but I know all the grapes have a different. Well, because all of the characters in this game have a different fighting style already. Thank you, Xenoverse, for not doing that. Um. But Fasha, I wasn't expecting her to keep her very, you know, ballerina-esque style in a, a form that's meant for just savagery. Oof! That looks like it hurt! Okay, let's... Where is your second super? Can you go away? Um, I can't grab you. Just go away. Oh! What the fuck was that? Stop. I love how he just extends his arm to do heavy attacks. Okay, super, super close away with the eye beam. Does this last one work on Darkness Blaster? That's probably the one he does with his hand. Or his mouth. And who cares? Um, he doesn't have a stun move, so I'm gonna just have to do it out of nowhere. Oh, it looks like your defense is lower, Fasha. How did that happen? How do I do this? Okay. Yeah, the mouth blast. Right, she just dodged it. But, you know, you get, you get the point. Ooh, I, his heavy attack is just so good. Like, it's not good for stunning because it can't. But it just does so much damage. Alright, let me show you some- OH! His- his fit as a grey ape genuinely looks amazing. That's all I can say. Like, the black pants with his white top and the, like, the blue shoes are kind of fucking ugly, but... Alright. Okay, I swapped to Wheeler. Whether that was an accident or not, not really actually because he's one of the best giants ever. Look at this speed, come on. Oof, hold on. Ooh. That's what I thought, run away. No, let me let me use my ultimate. Oh no. Okay. Okay. I just realized he's the second to last one. Baby's like right around the corner. Oh my god, that's great. Anyways, what is his ultimate? Oh, it's the fucking... It's the shit he tries to use against the spirit bomb. Oh, I may or may not... Oh, can I go through that? Oh! 
Oh, okay, no, I can't. Okay, you, you go for lucky this time. I'm gonna swap to something you can never hope to defeat. Are you ready? Are you ready? That's what I thought. Ooh, Herudagon. Look at his health. Look at his goddamn health. Oh, what? Oh, no. Oh, that did no damage. Hello? Rudigan slaps Jesus. Ooh. Yeah, stay right there. Stay right there. Okay, it was on the ground, so it did less damage. I don't care. Um, this fire blast hurts, so I hope you get hit. Yeah, that fire blast does way too much damage. That's like a quarter of a super, or a half of a super. Oh no, okay, it's the hardest guy. Um, I can't let him charge up, because he's just going to spam me. Ooh. Look how quick that comes out. God damn it! Look how much damage this is this fucking Harutagon! Oh my god, of course, baby, of course. Oh, yes, sir. Yes, sir. Please. You have to be kidding me. He's ob he's objectively the best giant character ever. On block, that did that much damage. More like on block. On god, it did that much damage. Okay, screw the mouth blast. I'm going to hit you with my own fire breath. Um, it may be an ultimate version, which does less damage than your super version. Because fucking great, baby, just that strong. <laughs> credit where it's due, they, they gave him the, the credit he deserves, but he's still, like, a very OP character. Again, when the game had him online, I'm sure it was just full of great babies. Uh-oh. Let's get it! That does, that does, okay, that does a little bit more damage than his. But a little bit. Only a little bit. Let's swap over to our final giant character. Ooh, Janempa. Oh, yeah, I bet you guys forgot Janempa was playable. Ooh. Lovely stuff. Alright. Hit him with this. Oh. 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 <laughs> oh, sorry, baby. Oh, that erased him from existence. Gone. Reduced atoms. God damn it, Janembo looks like he had a lot of fun. You know what? I had a lot of fun. A shorter Tenokachi video than most, I know, I know. But to be fair, this was the only idea I had planned for Budokai Tenokachi. I did read a ton of your comments, and someone actually did recommend that they did want to see uh, more Grey Apes, because I kept showing Grey Ape Baby, but none of the others. And to be fair, a bit immature of me. Uh, but there's actually still more. I didn't show Bardock, I didn't show Turles, I didn't show Raditz or Nappa. So I can save them for another video if you guys would like. Maybe... Obviously, you'll let me know what you want in the comments down below. Don't forget to leave a like as that greatly, again, supports the video. And don't forget to subscribe as it supports the channel greatly. <laughs> I'll see you guys in the next video. Take care and uh, peace. Cease.